We do one more. Yeah, one more. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Civilization VI. I nearly said CK2. Um, Gathering Storm, we continue our co op playthrough as the Maori and the Incans in the last episode. Uh, it was pretty much a build up a bunch of units and let's go destroy, take back what should be ours, and then we're going to burn all this stuff to the ground and march on Washington and laugh. It may take a couple episodes, but I think that we're almost in position to do that. I think we're going to have the necessary units to knock some of this stuff down. At least I hope we do. If we can just knock their walls down, I think it all will be well. We're thinning out the herd. Which is what we want to do. Good. If you need any horses or iron, I have Max. Alrighty. So, yeah, you know, my plan was to like be in and around this little mountain range, be maybe like four cities, play pretty tight, you know. Mm-hmm kind of build up but you know, that's what's interesting about this game compared to previous versions of Civ 6, 6. Um, I feel like I never really know what I'm doing until I get in and see the map and I think that's where this game has been the most successful I would agree it has that unique ability to feel like you're moving on the fly yeah, and I mean, I, I don't make the same decisions any any time. Mm-hmm. No, I understand that one completely. Got some nice little terrace farms doing the capital. Finally got my aqueduct down. That a boy. That's what I'm talking about. I'm going to try to seize her in Buenos Aires. I think I'm already there. No, no, no. I've got Babylon. They're all yours. They're all yours. All right. I think we're almost at a point where we're going to be ready to move in. This is going to be beautiful.
Get my special unit going. Culture bomb. I'm not sure why Machu is struggling so much, but it it it's got a little bit of the struggle bus bug. I mean, I know it's squeezed into in between two big cities, but <laughs> there's a reason I put it there. Mm-hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. Why in the world? Ooh, there he goes. Culture bomb, Robert De Bruce. So sorry, not sorry. That's some really interesting named cities. Chan Chan, <laughs> Utsuku, Machu, Kitokara, Wanuku, Pisak. That's funny. Yeah, we do. We definitely have some new ones. All right, so I got my city back. And we're now going to go burn all his other stuff down. I didn't get, to, I didn't get a chance to vote in that one. Really? Yeah. Kind of shocked by that. Did you join the crusade? I did not. They can crusade without me. <laughs> So you want peace? There will be no peace, Teddy. You started this war, my friend. I'm going to end it. End it. And end it I will.
And by end it, I basically mean that I'm going to murder all your other cities and take pride in murdering them. Congrats on getting back your city. Oh, I'm excited. So I'm going to murder those cities. I may keep one of them. Cincinnati looks promising. L.A., St. Oh. Louis, burning it. I don't know. Cincinnati's not on any water. This is true. However, you could build an aqueduct from that mountain. I don't know. We'll have to make a game time decision. I know I'm burning St. Louis to the ground. Yes, Los Angeles, I think, is the uh, prize there. Yeah, you're probably right. I forgot you can just pull... uh, I didn't realize everybody can pull uh, Aqueduct from a mountain. Yeah. It's super nice. All right, team, time to move out. Man, Canada missed a golden opportunity. Wait, Canada? Mm hmm. Of being on this map. Oh, 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 okay. I was like, I didn't know Canada was on this map. With uh, Robert DeVries on the map, we get that nice Scottish thing. Yeah. We do, don't we? You should come up and throw a city in. Well, I guess it would do terrible loyalty, but... Some beautiful jungle on a river right here. Next to Buenos Aires. Oh, that does sound nice. I got so much I need to do. This war is going to... has set back my normal goals.
Whoa. That's a lot of barbarians. That's unfortunate. Good session of the World Congress. Let's see what happens. Gandhi. Wow. Hmm. A lot of cities to manage right now. I think we need another builder burst. Yeah, I know the feeling. Screen. Yeah, I saw that. What? Oh, what's your play? Mm -hmm. She's playing as Pound Maker? Mm -hmm. You're on a big island by yourself. Well, actually, not by yourself. Petra too. So is, it, is that England? What? Who is that? Georgia. Yeah, Georgia. 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 Possibly the worst created sieve in the game. Yeah, for real. Sad. It is sad. No offense to Georgians or Tamiris. And is it Tamiris? No. Uh, Tamiris not, is pretty strong. Yeah, that's right. Tamiris is strong. She's Scythia. Um, yeah, no offense to Georgia, but not a big fan of their design. It's a sieve. Oh man.
updated government. Very nice. Which one'd you go with? Oh, good old uh, Merchant Republic, or not Merchant Republic? The exploration one. Is that Merchant yeah. Republic? Yeah, it is Merchant Republic. Yeah. Ooh, that's not cool. So he can now one shot my catapults. Okay. Not really happy about that, but. Catapults are so last year. Dude, they really are. That's not remotely frustrating. Whatsoever. Maybe we will make peace with him. Wait for the bombard. It's probably the right idea. Hello, Teddy. You're gonna give me a lot of gold. And you got a lot of cities. Give me your money. That's what you're going to do. And in the meantime, We're just going to hang out here. And do our thing. Yeah, I've got a lot of cities. I've got a lot of stuff I need to do with my cities, so... You build any wonders? Oh, no. We could build terrace farms in the middle of the water. I know, right? Wouldn't that be amazing? I mean, I know the Incans didn't figure that out, but like the Aztecs did. The Aztecs most definitely did. And I mean, it's not like the Aztecs were that far away. They could have shared some information. I don't know. It is the Aztecs we're talking about. They like to uh, human sacrifice it up, man.
Well, we got good news, Josh. What's that? You have not produced any carbon emissions yet. <laughs> oh, just wait. Oh man, is my water source really gonna be up there? Of all my cities, I'm not gonna have any niter. This seems to be a recurring theme. I have to go throw down a city up there. I think you're gonna have to. considered this is going well yeah it's going better than I anticipated it going I'll tell you that I mean I know you lost that city but we got and it back we got it back we, and we scared position. scared him into a decent enough peace treaty till he get tries to get cheeky again Now we just have a lot of building that we need to do, but we're making crazy amounts of money right now. Which I'll take. Making 88 ducats per turn. Gold, not ducats. Really, you're gonna settle Cleveland right there? That's cute. Just giving me another target to burn down. I like it. All right, Drew. Should I put a uh, a? Uh, oh man, hey. Campus district or a terrace farm on that one next to Kit Dukara. All right, let me find it. Which tile are we talking about? The one where the builder is? Well, the one that's going to be in that C. Um, whew. I mean, it would be a good spot for a terrace farm because you have access to fresh water. Mm -hmm. Yes, I. I mean, it's a great spot for either. Yeah. It is. It is.
I think I'm gonna put a science district there. Yeah, or you could put the science district on the marsh. It's not ideal, but at least we get plus one from the geothermal right there. No, that's that's a wonder. Never mind. That's not geothermal. I mean, a natural wonder. Yeah. Never mind. Scratch that. What would really be nice is if you could like buy two tiles, that mountain tile and that spot that Gandhi has is encroaching on. That's, that's what I'm saying. The one that's in the middle of the... Yeah, the little enclave of mountains. I, that would be probably the best. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's the that's the spot. I'm that wondering. is the spot. Disagree. You need to put. You need to build a sea lab in that mm -hmm. lake, but still call it a sea lab because that makes perfectly good sense. Dark Age. Heck yes. Did I go? I went to a dark age too. Oh, that's not good. Oh, this is this is good. Oh shoot! Rebellion in eleven turns. That is not good. Um. Yeah, I'm seeing this too. Not real happy about this. All right, I think we may need to reassign a governor. Oh, rebellion in 17 turns? What? Oh, we need some loyalty, something. Dude, you're not kidding. You are not kidding one bit. Okay, I need to... Please tell me y'all are okay from a loyalty standpoint. Alright, that's good. Alright guys, well, we're going to go ahead and cut it up. We're already five minutes over. I hope you enjoyed it. I know that we did, and we'll pick it up next time.